Hey everyone, today I'm going to be replacing the bumpers, rail guards, and float plates on my one wheel pine. So the reason I'm putting my old float plates back on is because my new solo float plate had not arrived yet and I wanted to ride the board. And here I am removing the Float Life rail guards. And as you can see, they did a great job of keeping those rails in perfect shape. This is probably the most important step when you're reapplying rail guards. You want to make sure that you have a nice clean surface. And I also like to clean the bumpers a little bit because those rail guards are going to go onto the bumpers by about an eighth of an inch on each side. Now before I peel off the plastic film on the rail guards, I'm going to use something with a hard edge to get rid of any air bubbles or inconsistencies. And here I have the new solo float plate from the Float Life. I was very excited to get this just because I like how it looks. I like how it covers up the whole bottom of the one wheel and I love that it has that handle. That's something that I truly do miss from my XR and it'll be nice to have. I think Float Life did an awesome job with the new Solo Float Plate. I love that it covers the whole bottom of the board. I really like how it wraps around the bumper and I think the handle is great too. So here's the finished product. New bumpers, rail guards, and the solo flow plate. Last but not least, here's Molly enjoying the one wheel. If you like what you saw, please subscribe to my channel, and I'll have more content coming soon. Thanks for watching.